Hello there, my name is Edmund Munoz. I'm in fourth grade. I go to Will Rogers, and this is my mission tour. Anyways, let's begin. Oh, hello there. Welcome to the San Buenaventura Mission. I will be touring you today. My name is Edmund, and for the f and f this is I have been touring for the first time today. So you will be my first tour ever. <sighs> All right, come on, let's go inside. The mission was built by Junipero Serra with the help of Native Americans in 1782. It was also the ninth mission that Serra built in the 21 missions of California. Come on, let's sit down and talk about the history of this church. A little bit of it, though. The church is made by adobe bricks and tile floors and tile ceilings. The, mi the mission in 1816 had over 41,000 animals, including 23,400 cattle, 12,144 sheep, and 4,493 horses. The first church had been destroyed in a fire in 1793, and the second church in 1816 Had, had been reconstructed after an earthquake. They had grown so many crops, apples, oranges, fig, bananas, grapes, pear, corn, plums, coconuts, grain, beans, grains, and barley. Fun fact about the mission, it has a nickname, and the nickname is Mission by the Sea. The mission also had wooden bells that were only used the week before Easter Sundays. Way before metal bells were used. I hope you're enjoying your tour today because we are already halfway done. Anyways, let's continue. There used to be aqueducts that would give water to the mission from seven miles away. But then it was abandoned in 1862, after it had been destroyed by floods. Father Cyprian had modernized the interior of the church by painting over the original artwork. The windows were lengthened with five 4x12 glass windows, and little, little design of the original building was left there and the and in my opinion the most interesting thing about the mission is about how much it went through over the years like the modernizing the fire floods and earthquake anyways i hope you enjoyed your i hope you enjoyed our tour today and to this day, the mission is still a great part of Ventura. Okay, goodbye and have a great day.